hope you guys are prepared to be amazed by some of the most satisfying Lego animations ever. This is going to be awesome. Hello, everybody. I'm Kyle Lakeard, and today we're having a breakfast made of Lego. These are Lego stop motion animations by Tomostein, a channel that you should definitely check out. These are so cool. Look at this. If Lego food looked this good, I might actually eat it. That's a piece of bread that the dude just put in the, the oven. He's gonna cut this? It turned into Legos! What the heck? Okay, that is... That is awesome. Okay, so we got lettuce. We got some tomato. Are we cutting the... They're gonna... Slice it right in half. That is just unreal. The, it's so cool. I love this. An orange? Wait. The orange didn't become Lego. What'd you do? Oh! <laughs> I only eat my food if it becomes Lego when I cut it. A kiwi. Okay. It's freaking me out, man. That's so insane. It, I just, I love this. Oh, you got to make, yeah, you got to make your, your coffee or your tea or whatever it is. This is coffee. This is coffee. Yes. The, the fire. You got, you got blue flame. <laughs> yep. Throw in some, uh, butter. Is that butter? Like you got butter the pan. Oh gosh. Oh, it's getting brown. It's getting browned up. Oh, it's okay. It's getting a little burnt. Are those onions, baby? I don't know. Whatever. This is so cool. Why is it black? Did the butter turn black? Oh, was he? Oh, he was roasting the coffee beans. Okay, I've never done that before. How do you powderize? Oh my gosh, they're turning into smaller Legos. Yep. Yep. Uh -huh. That makes sense. That makes sense. Okay, so he roasted his own coffee beans. Man, that's something that I am not willing to do. To pour some hot Lego water on top of that, and then out comes the the percolated coffee Lego. <laughs> oh my gosh, that looks so cool. I love this. And, and to be completely honest, I've never seen these before. This is the first time I've ever seen these videos. I've only seen the thumbnails, so I'm experiencing this for the first time ever. I hope that you guys are too, but if you're not, I hope that you're just enjoying the ride. That's a cat. It's cat toast. The cat toast doesn't want the, that jam. He doesn't like it. Oh, okay. Don't let him, don't let him see it. Is it going to turn? It's going to turn into Lego. Of course it's going to turn into... And then it spreads. That's unbelievable. Oh my gosh, it's so satisfying. Such a perfect layer of of strawberry jam right there. Oh man, I'm getting hungry. Th these are plastic pieces, and I'm getting hungry. Okay, so you got your you got your coffee, your kiwi, your fruit. Eat some tomatoes. <laughs> Eat some lettuce. This is crazy. Yeah, that's some good kiwi right there. Did you know you can eat the outside of a kiwi? I had no idea. Um, yep. Leaving the skin. Drink some of that coffee. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. But I might. You ever wonder where Oreos come from? We're about to find out. Because we are in a Lego Oreo factory. The animals. The animals make the Oreos? I knew it. I knew it! Humans can't make such a delicious cookie. It's the animals. Okay, what do you got there? Is that chocolate? Oh my gosh, it's so complicated. What is that? What's in there? Oreo flavoring? Butter. Turns into Lego, of course it does. So you gotta, you gotta mix the, the butter. Mix that up. Oh, that's awesome! Got yourself an egg. Wait, what's gonna happen to the egg? 
Oh, it's getting... Okay, it's getting blended inside of the shell. That's pretty cool, too. And there goes the egg juice. Gross, but also pretty cool. Everything's automated and just so awesome. That Okay, that's a Lego banana. That lever was is a banana. Oh. Okay, so you got the the that that must be for the the creamy center of an Oreo, and then of course that's the the chocolate cookie part of the Oreo. I think I've never made an Oreo. It's getting all blended up. But why? Or maybe no, you're making they're they're making the cookie that was flour, not not the creamy center. We still have to make the creamy center. We're making the cookie part. Yes? You've got a cookie extruder? <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so cool. <laughs> oh, this is so, so cool. All right. And then, okay, so we've got the bottom of the cookie, right? Yes? And then they're, they're going to keep making cookies. These are going to get baked up real nice to the... the the oven is at the perfect temperature for Oreo cookie baking. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Got to cool them off a little bit. That makes sense. Oh, it gets flipped. And then you add the cream. And then you put the top and you smash it down. <laughs> that is so cool. Blip. Oh, man. I love this. And then I love how it gets squished down and it fills the space. That's so cool. So that's it. That's a done Oreo, right? Like, like they're good. Is what? Is there another step? Oh, I guess like maybe packaging, possibly. I don't know. Oh, and look at look at watch this. Watch this. Look at the weight. See how the cookie kind of like, like bends over the edge because it's like still warm right like it's still kind of like like moldable that one broke we got a broken oreo cookie we can't have that we need we need a quality assurance to take care of that broken oreo oh here he is he's inspecting we can only send out the most perfect oreos good good that one's good the broken one's coming though there it is i see it i see it what's he gonna do about it Red alert. Not good. <laughs> Kill it! And then eat it. I mean, you don't want... I mean, sure, it's not a perfect Oreo, but it's still good. Right, we're moving on to packaging. Whoa! That one had... I don't know why that one was heavier than the others. For some reason. Oh my gosh. Oh, and the way that the lights light up. The yellow lights. So you see where they're going? Okay, what's that? It spits out a perfectly made package of Oreos in what I can only assume is Japanese. Yum. Eat them up. It's pretty good. You gotta dip it in some milk, though. We all know Oreo is milk's favorite cookie. Oh, my God. The way that it changed colors when he dipped it in the milk. Oh, man, I'm going to start eating Legos, maybe. No. Fight your urges. All right, who wants some Lego chocolate cake? I know I do. Going in. Into the kitchen. We got ourselves some eggs, some flour, some chocolate powder. Oh, that was awesome. The yolk. Oh my gosh, how do you make solid plastic blocks look like liquid? This is how you do that. That's unreal. And the way everything moves when he pours stuff in. So good. I want to see it get mixed. Oh, that's cute. Oh, they're going to watch. Okay, blend it up. Blend it all up. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, it kind of changes color. It kind of turns like white. Right? Well, okay. Off-white. More like beige. Now we add the flour. We're, we're adding in the dry ingredients. 
I don't, that must be cocoa powder, maybe. Or maybe it's just chocolate cake batter. I don't really know. I'm terrible at baking. I cannot bake for the life of me. And we gotta mix all that together too. Hey, a cow. Is that milk? I guess that's milk. Made by a Lego cow. That makes sense that Lego cows would make Lego milk. Now we gotta get all that stuff incorporated. That's, you know, the technical term. Nice brown batter. <laughs> oh, the, and the noises. Of... Oh, so good. Little sheet cake. Perfect. Normally you gotta, like, when you pour the cake batter, you kind of have to, like, shake it a little bit to get it, like, nice and even. Oh my gosh, watching it bake. Oh, that's so cool. That's, that's so good. Okay, so, this, this, I think, is, like, phase one. Oh, gotta cut it, of course. Cut it in nice, even sections. It's easy with Lego. Oh, the way that it, like, droops like that. Now what are we doing? Okay, that's cool. I want one of those. So we've got real chocolate. Oh, that one broke in the middle. That's that's okay. Are we melting it? What are we doing? I again, like I don't know enough about baking to. Oh, there's nothing in there. But I. Oh, he's probably making the frosting. Is that milk? That was a lot of milk that came out of that little cup. That's so impressive. Uh, I, okay. I think this is the frosting. Probably. It's getting... It, see, it's kind of like... It's, it's building up because it's getting like... Like uh, like frothy, I guess. Yep, there you go. Yeah, that's the frosting. Oh my gosh, that's so good. Oh, it's so perfect. Oh, it's so perfect. Oh, wait. Little extra. Yeah. Okay, then no, that's fine. It's a layer cake. That is a that is a beautiful cake. I I'm legitimately hungry now. Yep. Oh, you got some squishing out of the edges. You gotta clean that up. There you go. There you go. <laughs> I just, oh, the attention to detail is so good. Okay, are we doing another layer, or are we just? Oh, we're doing something. Yeah, okay. Top layer of frosting. Smooth it out. Make it nice and clean. Ooh, cut up some of that chocolate. We got chocolate chips. You sprinkle those on top. That's a good looking cake. The cats are, are feeling good about it too. Give me a slice. Give me a slice. It looks delicious and satisfying all at the same time. It's gorgeous. That is the most beautiful chocolate cake I've ever seen, and it's not even edible. Oh, we're making Lego tea. <laughs> Cause why not? Have some Lego tea with your uh with your chocolate cake. Is it gonna start changing colors? Of course it is. It's very red tea. I wonder what kind of tea that is. Okay, you just removed that dude's head. They were wearing masks. That's good. Little decoration. Oh, you got something on your hand. You see that? Yeah, I don't know if that was like some like batter or something that got on his hand during the cooking process, but that was awesome. Now that we've learned how to make chocolate cake, let's make a Lego Oreo cake. Milk's favorite cookie. Oh, okay, get it. Yep, get out your Lego vacuum. That's a really good vacuum. Very effective. Where does it put all that stuff? Either way. I need this. Okay, it's gonna turn it into Lego. We can't eat it like that. It, no, yep, separate the cookie from the cream. I gotcha. But we can't, we can't eat those, those real Oreos. Gross. We need them to be Lego. They're, okay, good. I was getting worried. I want real Oreos? Ugh. That dog didn't look so good. Okay. Is that butter? A lot of butter. Is it butter? Why is there holes in it? 
I was gonna say it's cheese, but I don't think you put cheese in into cakes. Unless maybe cream cheese. Maybe it's cream cheese. I don't know. That's milk. Pretty sure. Whisk that up. Get that nice and bubbly. Add a little froth. All right. Yeah. Then we add in the dry ingredients. Okay. We're making some kind of Oreo based cream filling, I suppose. <laughs> Wait, sticks to the spoon and he has to knock it off. Oh, man. Okay. Oh, that was awesome. Very impressive. Don't, no, no. Those are real Oreos. Someone's going to choke on those. Okay, hopefully they turn into Lego Oreos when they get baked. I'm just going to assume. <laughs> that, is, that is so cool. It is just unreal. The, the, the skill and attention that's required to make these videos is crazy. And it is awesome. And you guys need to go subscribe to this channel because these take so much work and so much talent and they are so fun to watch i want a oreo cake made out of lego now the work <laughs>